Moon Young, Blu-ray, Plain Archive, Limited Edition, gotta get it now. This is Limited Edition number 48. Moon Young is another Korean film to join the Plain Archive collection, so that's great news in of itself. And it also is very important to note that this movie is only just over 60 minutes, so there's not a lot of film here. Very low budget, very independent film. Plain Archive does include another short film from the director, so that kind of helps out with the short running time. So in this movie, Moon Young, played by Kim Tae Di, um, is a high school, she, I think this is her last year, um, she's 18 years old and she's mute. Uh, she, so she's kind of a loner. She prefers to see the world through her sort of handheld digital camera, perceiving the world through that lens, kind of just getting into her own world. Um, she's very, very unfortunate. She comes, um, she's, her mom is out of the picture. Her dad's a, a drunk in the worst kind of way. Um, and she's pretty much taking care of herself. She's on her own. Uh, she gets involved with an older girl, a uh, girl who's about 10 years older, 28 years old, in a very sort of unconventional relationship. Um, borderlines on something a little bit more, but it's it's much more of a, a friendship, sort of a, a motherly connection, also possibly more. Um, a little bit a little bit strange I have to I have to say um, if that girl had been a guy it would have been a little bit weird because you know he's offering her beer and hang trying to push to hang out with her and things like that so it is it is an interesting setup um, Kim Tae you might know her she was the younger actress in the handmaiden she was the handmaiden um, she was in 1987 a little forest She's one of my new favorite up-and-coming young Korean actresses. She's amazing. Um, but yeah, in this movie, since she does not speak, she's mute, that you're not going to see her, you know, giving a lot of lines. And um, it's a very subtle, very nuanced performance that she gives. Let's take a look at this awesome Blu-ray package. One thing I do notice about this full slip case that's really nice is um, it's got sort of that kind of pearl coating finish that I like to call it. I'm not sure if that's the correct name. So there is the Plain Archive exclusive sticker. As you can see, this one is tailor-made for this film. Um, very nice, very awesome. Loving the sticker on this one. Okay, so the full slip case is really nice with that uh, kind of pearl coating finish that I had said. Um, getting into the goodies here. Okay, we do have a little booklet as well as the Scanavo keep case. Alright, so the booklet, I do like that cover uh, with the actress on there and the back has a little director's note, okay, so obviously written in Korean there. Um, sort of looks like a little bit of a poem, um, more than a note, but um, not totally sure. So inside this booklet, this is pretty much what every page looks like. Um, um, this does look like it is the sort of uh, script or I would say maybe shooting script for the film. Okay, It has all the different scenes and the various dialogue all in Korean. No pictures. Um, so this is kind of just a cool addition for the film. So international fans, you might not be getting a lot out of this other than just having a cool book. So the keep case. Uh, has sort of a little bit of a blurry kind of hard to make out that's her with the video camera there she kind of walks around with a little video recorder in the front um, kind of a kind of a blurry picture of her the main actress her face there kind of hard to see inside no envelope we got a disc and it looks like some photo cards there oh these cards have um, the title in Korean, uh, Moon Young, on the back of the card, written written in kind of a silver, uh, it's a nice writing there. Okay, so that is on the back of the card. It's kind of a nice touch, uh, nothing, nothing too crazy. Okay, they've got the main actress there. Okay. There's 
the two main actresses. It's her friend that she makes. It's her again. So fans of the film, I think, are going to be pretty happy with these uh, little postcards here. Pretty nice. We got the disc. I really like that disc. And the inside of the package. So I really love when um, the Blu-ray companies, especially in Korea, put together a great package for a Korean film. Uh, so I do want to say again that this is a very, very small, independent Korean film. I don't think this is the best representation of what independent Korean cinema can do, but I think it's a pretty good representation. The short film that's included on this, there's no English subtitles, but it is also a film that doesn't have that much dialogue. So it's, a, it's, a, it's very watchable, um, and I actually really enjoyed it the additional short film that was put on here so uh for for super fans of korean cinema and plain archive collection completists this is obviously a must buy for people that are just getting into korean cinema and um, want sort of more of the bigger pictures bigger glossier productions this probably isn't the movie for you so um an awesome new plain archive title and a uh, pretty great package overall so if you guys also picked this one up, I'm curious about your thoughts on the film. Uh, it sort of had me, you know, in lukewarm reaction to this movie. Uh, didn't totally love it, but I might have missed some aspects. Uh, so, you know, very welcome to hear your thoughts in the comments section below. So if you guys do like uh, these videos and you want to see more, Blu-ray uh, showcase videos and mini Korean film reviews or Korean Blu-ray reviews, Korean film reviews, English subtitled Korean movie trailers. Stay tuned to the channel. Uh, you can support us by liking the video. You can share. You can subscribe to stay up to date with all of our future updates. Until next time, this is Tyler from The Movie Beat. Keep watching movies.